Hi everyone, in this lesson we will now assemble our components. Go into our main file, right click, and select show all components. And as a rule of thumb, make sure that our reference component is always grounded. So our reference component is our box pivot. Right click and select ground. Let's now rearrange our components. Selecting this one, moving this one here, same here, and this ball, moving this one here. And as you can see, we are not allowed to move our box pivot because it's grounded. Before grabbing our joint tool, I'd like to select this plane, so left click. So notice, there's an indication that our plane is inside our post handle. So expanding this one and turning off this bulb. And from here, let's now hit J to grab our join tool and select capture position. Now hitting cancel and hitting J once more. Now if I hit continue instead of capture position, our component will move back to its original position. So selecting continue, notice. So selecting cancel, hitting J once more and selecting capture position instead. Now for the component one, let's grab our post handle. So zooming in here. Now our intent is to mate this hole with the hole of our box pivot. The motion type selecting revolute. I'm going to hover over here, hold control, and select this component reference. Left click. Now zooming in here, I'm going to right click and select between two faces. Selecting this face and this face. Hovering over here, holding control and selecting this component reference. So notice. Our post handle snapped into place, rotate to be at Z axis. Let me show animate and hit OK. Heading to home view. Next, let's assemble our link to join our post handle. Zooming in and hitting J to grab our join tool. Moving to our link, I'm going to right click and select between two faces, selecting this face and this face, holding control and selecting this component reference, left click. Now moving to our post handle, zooming in here, holding control and selecting this component reference, left click. Now the motion type to be revolute. Hitting animate. And finally, hitting OK. So moving this one. I'm going to hit J to grab our join tool and move into our handle. I'm going to hold control and select this component reference. Next, moving to our post handle, hovering over this face, holding control and selecting this component reference. Operation or motion type to be rigid and hitting OK. Inspecting and going to visual style, selecting wireframe. So confirm it is properly in place and going back to shaded with visible edges only. Going to home view. So notice in the real world, our components should not be overlapping with one another. Now to simulate this one, we are going to assemble and selecting enable contact sets. And going back to assemble, 
selecting new contact set now we want this component should not be interfering with our box pivot so selecting this one as well same with our post handle our post handle should not be going way past our box pivot and finally hit OK so notice if I drag my handle so that is the usage of enable contact set awesome congratulations for completing our December challenge Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year to all God bless